Hello everyone, it's Val here. I'm back to show you a, another box that I packed for Operation Christmas Child. Um, this box is for a boy in the age range of 10 to 14, and it is a sports themed box. And I used a regular shoe box, slightly larger shoe box. I decorated the lid with scrapbook paper, which I adhered with clear packaging tape. And this box bulges a little, and so I had to close it with several rubber bands, but there's a lot in here, so I'm real happy with the way it turned out. So inside the box, I'll show you what I packed. On the inside of the lid, um, I um, put another piece of scrapbook paper and it says champs. And um, I added the phrase with sticker letters, jump for joy, Jesus loves you. Right on top, I put a pair of underwear. These are boxers and I got them um, in a uh, package of six uh, yesterday that were on, on clearance at Walmart. And they're actually men's size small, but I think they'll work. Um, it says on the packaging that um, they um, have a, uh, a waist size of 28 to 30. And I looked it up online and it looks like that'll be okay for a 14 year old boy. I also packed a soccer ball. Um, I got my soccer ball at Walmart. It wasn't the cheapest one that they have, but um, my Walmart hasn't had those cheap ones for a pretty long time. It seems like they're not restocking their shelves at Walmart. I don't know about you, but that's what I've noticed. <laughs> Inside the ball, I have a, I deflated it and I have a pump in the box also because that's pretty important to include when you have a deflated ball. I packed a shirt, um, it has a basketball. Um, looks like the basketball is on fire. <laughs> it's a really nice shirt. It's um, long sleeved. It's an extra large for a boy, 10 to 14. And I think I got it for $4 on clearance at Walmart. I also packed a lizard beanie baby, Thai beanie baby. Um, I love his colors. He's blue on top with black spots and orange, orange and yellow on the bottom. I packed a couple of pairs of socks. And... I packed a mini flashlight. I put that flashlight in this baggie um, along with some extra batteries and I put tape around the ends of the batteries which is, which is what Operation Christmas Child suggests that you do. And I tied the bag. It's a real cute bag. It's got um, sports balls on it. Um, and I tied it with a ribbon. Uh, the ribbon I just got yesterday on clearance at Walmart. It has soccer balls on it. I packed a drawstring um, tote bag, backpack tote bag. I packed a bar of soap, a comb, a lip balm, a few band-aids, and his washcloth is a uh, magic towel, um, has Spider-Man on it. I packed an Uno game. These were on sale um, not too long ago at Target. Um, they had like special edition, um, edition uh, versions that were on sale because normally these are pretty pricey. They were like half price, I think. I packed a little mini bowling game. I think he'll have fun with that. Pencil sharpener. Fidget spinner. 
This one really spins. I love it. I packed a pair of shoes, a brand new pair of shoes that I got at Walmart. Um, they're pretty nice shoes. They weren't terribly expensive, $9.98, but I really wanted to pack a pair. I splurged on these. Um, I don't know if you've seen any of the photos that Operation Christmas Child has posted um, of children in Madagascar who have received boxes. And I noticed that most of the boys in those photos are barefoot. And I just, I don't know, I think it'd be hard to kick a soccer ball if you don't have a good pair of shoes. So inside the shoes, I stuffed um, most of his school supplies. Um, because if I put the school supplies in his pencil pouch, um, then I couldn't make everything fit in the box. So I'll show you what I stuffed inside the shoes. A hacky sack ball. Scissors. Some pencil top erasers. I've got a football. A basketball. A soccer ball. He's got a glue stick. He's got a dry erase marker. He's got some Sharpie pens. He's got a nice big eraser. It says oops on it. He's got a fun pencil. This came in a multi-pack from the Dollar Tree. It's real cute. It has sports balls on it and a football um, eraser. He's got two highlighters, yellow and green. He's got another dry erase marker and a third dry erase marker. This one's not as fat. He's got some um, I can get him out. Oh. He's got some Ticonderoga pencils and um, these came pre-sharpened and so I had covered the the tops of these but it must have come off when I was pulling it out of the shoe. He's got some novelty pencils that have footballs on them and I also sharpened those and I covered them um, with washi tape so that the lead wouldn't get all inside the shoe. He's got a couple of ink pens, ballpoint pens. He's got four felt tip pens. He's got a six inch ruler, um, which is also a snap wrist bracelet. There's the cover I had on those pencils, which I will put back on and secure a little better. In this shoe, I stuffed a football egg, Easter egg, um, and I put washi tape around it because it kept popping open. So it's okay, I can reseal it. I'll show you what I put in it. Um, I put some pencil cap erasers. I put four bouncy balls. Um, I got these in um, a giant multi-pack and I think I got them from Oriental Trading, pretty sure. I got them a few years ago and I just had so many, I still have some left. I put in a cross necklace I got this from Hobby Lobby. It's part of their Playside Creations collection. He's got a toothbrush with a cap. He's got his eight inch air pump to inflate his soccer ball. It comes with one um, needle for the pump and I added a package of two more needles. He's got a uh, harmonica. He's got 
another comb, a bigger comb. And that's what I stuffed inside his shoes. I also um, included a pack of colored pencils. And here is his pencil pouch that he can put all of his school supplies in that I had stuffed in the shoe. This is my note to the child I wrote inside this card. This is a Christmas card that I actually sent out as our family Christmas card a few years ago. It's real cute. It says St. Louis Cardinals on it. And it says joy and the O in joy is a baseball St. Louis Cardinals baseball and I just wrote a note and stuck in our family photo. He's got a notebook, college college rule, 70 sheets. He's got a, a challenging um, adult color by number coloring book. Um, this is mostly why I included those felt tip pens. I thought between his um, colored pencils and his felt tip pens, he would really enjoy coloring in this book. Last but not least, I put in a play mat. I make these play mats out of scrapbook paper. I laminate them and, uh, and then tape them together in the middle so that they fold. You know, they can also fold on this side and the blank, um, the blank on the, on the opposite side um, can be used as dry erase and that is why I included the dry erase markers. So that's it for my sports box for a boy age 10 to 14. Um, if you enjoyed watching I hope you'll hit the like button and subscribe to my channel and please um, if you have any ideas or suggestions I'd love to hear them I always enjoy reading your comments so thanks for watching see you next time